Hi, I'm Josh. I'm Ollie. And I'm Jesse from Top Jaw. And we are here today because you are going to introduce us to what I've heard is the best pub food in London. This is not just the best pub food in London, this oh. is one of the best places in London. Okay. Full stop. Wow. wow. I have been coming here since like 2011 because I used to live nearby. And I've since moved away, Okay. but I've always come back. Like a yeah. salmon. Like a boomerang. Like, yeah, like a boomerang. <laughs> Recently got engaged, boys. We're having our engagement party here. I have my 30th here. So this place is a, a part of yeah. you. Yeah. You're like a salmon that, that swam away into the Atlantic. Are you obsessed with salmon? Yeah. yeah. Can we make sure we have some yeah. salmon? No, 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 no. <laughs> and this yeah. here is another Jesse. He lives upstairs, it's okay. his place, but his menu's awesome. He seems very passionate I about can't the tell food you too much. in here. Yeah. I mean, we walked in and he was like, is it okay if I just fill your table with food? And I'm yeah. like, no, no, you're speaking my language. Yeah. Yes, please. I think he described uh, it as a tsunami. Okay. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> he did. Uh, that was verbatim yeah. what he said. You're not even, you're not even jazzing up. Yeah. Oh, wow. oh. What on earth is happening? So we've got frozen margaritas. Wow. But if you want to get it funky, you can get it funky. Or you have the grapefruit and the chili and the squeezy bit and the, all that. If you want the berry number, if you want extra lime, if you want lavender, wow. tastes like granny's knickers. Okay. <laughs> and uh, it's called a DIY margarita. Let's go. Fantastic. Cheers, Jesse. Wow. This is like the Pizza, Pizza Hut salad bar this is. of margaritas. <laughs> I want some of this. What is this? What is that? It's got a It's pipette. like a chili. Ooh. My Ooh. Ooh. I don't know what it is. Oh, just... dear Lord. Here, yeah, give this a taste. Give this a taste, guys. Put it on your finger. Actually, oh. just stick it straight in my gob. Uh, oh, okay. Okay. There we go. Boom. Little droplet. Mm. Three, three droplets in there. Oh, actually, I don't know. That kind of gathers pace, boys. It's spicy. It's That's really like you saying bolt. Oh my God. Mmm. <laughs> oh, that is lovely. You guys have quite a lot of history. You know, you've filmed an episode together. Yeah, without you. That's you know, true. without me. A little birdie told me that you guys go back even further than that. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> Oh, let's get back to you. You guys were assigned to the same agency when no. you were modeling. No, no. Different not, agencies. Yeah, different they agencies. started with the same letter. Ah. I must have been signed to a different agency as well. <laughs> okay, um, okay. <laughs> may I say, you both still got it, okay. obviously. Wow. Okay. Um, but you're both, you're both kind of entering the kind of Wellman Vita Biotics modeling okay. phase, I would wow. say. You know, you could, you could, excuse me, you could model for vitamins. Okay, <laughs> like, great. Like, look, hasn't this specimen aged well? Yeah, exactly. Like, yeah. like David right. Doesn't he feel comfortable? Yeah, okay. yeah. What, exactly. <laughs> Wouldn't you like to show him to your nan? <laughs> yeah. okay. Right, look, Jeez. cheers guys to, uh, oh, to good pub food. Chang. Jan, very good. Jan. Very, very good. No, that. Right, we've had enough fruit wow. salads. Oh, okay. We These margaritas are incredible, Jesse. What is salmon. this? Salmon. Oh, salmon? Nice. There you go. Oh my gosh. Guys, this is a tsunami food. We have <laughs> duck liver profiteroles with orange and pistachio nuts. Traditional British brown food. <laughs> Today's bread. We've got last week's bread. No. We've got chips because we thought you might still be hungry. Okay, fair enough. Ollie cannot resist some chips. Jesse, being the king of the castle in the middle, is going to get a cow pie. Now, the cow pie is a whole cow and a whole pie inspired by this guy. Oh, now, Desperate Dan. Desperate Dan was a famous cowboy with a bristly chin okay. and a well fed figure. <laughs> And a hat. Very good. And Very Desperate Dan used to have the same dinner every day. Is a whole cow in a whole pie with horns coming out the top and a tail coming out the side. I'm very, very excited for you guys I to try so this. I am so overwhelmed. Oh, this is like God. Jesse. This is unreal. Who's I mean, I, I'm to both, to both <laughs> Jesse. Both Jesse. This is unreal. Jesse is the plural term, like a gaggle of swans. Okay. <laughs> when you text me saying, "Yeah, Jesse, this is what I want to do." Yeah. Take us to your best pub food in London. Yeah. There was zero question in my mind. I love that. I was like, cool, we're going to This is so good. Yeah. This has a lot of black treacle in it. Black yes, treacle? Yes, which gives it a real chew wow. and it's super sweet. And then that butter, I mean, that's like, we're talking, you know, it looks like we're at a Michelin star restaurant now. That's ridiculous. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's good. Mm. You can taste the, mm. is it treacle? Mm. Well, I think the butter. 
I'm going to the bathroom. I'm going to the bathroom. Right, okay. Right. That's happening. <laughs> Is everyone okay with that? <laughs> That's so dark. Right, I really want you to try chestnut hummus, which, by the way, right. is a bit of a paradox because right. hummus, hummus is made with lentils. Right? Hummus means chickpeas. Chickpeas. Oh. So in Arabic, I didn't like know hummus. <laughs> I've always thought it was lentils. In place of chickpeas, there is no chestnuts. No, it's not a mix. It's all chestnut. Get a little bit of pita. So you know, you've been doing this for a long time. Often people get a little bit weirded out by how comfortable we are sharing food. You okay with you with sharing? Yeah, but when the camera stopped, we're allowed to make out. So <laughs> <laughs> We don't make out. <laughs> in. Okay. And it's really sweet. Mm. Oh my. Mmm. It almost tastes a bit like caramel, caramelized mm. oniony. It does. You know? There's a little bit of sourness in so there. Oh good. Grace, you need to try this. I mean it's definitely yeah. chestnut. Yeah. Right? Okay. Boom. Yeah. Mmm. Chestnuts so aren't good. just for Christmas, boys. No. That is Evidently so not. good. Texture is beautiful. Aiden, go. Boom. <clears throat> Oh, he, he, yeah. he gave a flat hand like he was feeding a horse a shoe. <laughs> <laughs> that was interesting. He didn't, yeah. he didn't use his opposable yeah. thumb to okay. like, <laughs> plate me. Yeah. Now it's duck liver profiterol time. Okay. Duck liver profiterol. And I'm just going on my fingers because I'm a heathen. So, so profiteroles are usually just filled with cream, that. right? Okay. Yeah, they're like a French dessert, right? Yes. And it looks like pistachio or something on top. All in one. Mm -hmm. Just wow. Yeah. Wow. Oh my. Holy a, there's a lot of flavour in there. Yeah. Holy crap. I'm really crap. glad I wasn't expecting that to be a profiterole. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that, I think that may be. Here we go. Here trouble. we go. You probably get in trouble as well for saying things are your favourite. I, I've watched a whole bunch of Jollies, okay. and in most episodes, you say. No. Yeah. There's not something. most. Something. I've seen you not at like most. a Texas truck stop, and you're going. Yeah. This is the best Texas meal of my was life. Hilarious. No, okay, yeah. all right. <laughs> Texas was great. Get food. your bingo great food in Texas. Out, everyone. I think it's my favourite thing I've had in a in a British pub. Oh, that's fair enough. That's not the yeah. highest bar. In the world. No, I may be yeah, yeah. famous for superlatives, but that is incredible, Jesse. That's amazing. Yeah, yeah, but you haven't tried any of this. Yeah, we're working our way through it. Let's go. You need to give that its due. It's Guys, due. Like volume's got quite high. Just this. Don't yes. live a pate. Most yes. of the reason my wife married me. I'm almost I'm... ready to marry you, Jesse. So I don't blame I'm her. Good. I don't blame her. Quick break from today's video because this is a paid partnership with BetterHelp. I actually have been getting therapy this year through BetterHelp, and I found it to be really useful. Whatever stage you are in life, there can be a lot going on, and for me, I found it really helpful with dealing with stress and anxiety, and BetterHelp has helped me find a therapist really easily. Having said that though, finding a therapist can be hard, but BetterHelp's mission is to make therapy accessible. To get started, all I had to do was just answer a few questions about my needs and preferences, and they matched me with one of their credentialed therapists in just a few days. If for any reason you do want to switch to a new therapist, there's no additional charge. It's all online and remote, so I can message my therapist anytime and schedule a live session whenever is good for me. And speaking from my experience, I really couldn't recommend BetterHelp more. I think it's, it's just worth giving a try. And if you would like to give it a try, then click the link in the description, go to betterhelp.com forward slash jolly. You can get 10% off your first month and you also help support us and the content we're making. Back to the video. So next up, we're going for this. So this is a Desperate Dan cow pie. Always has been on the menu, Look always will be on the menu. at that pastry. Steak and ale, and they put beef within the pastry. And this is bone in the middle. If I just take this little like, moss off, this is a parsley and bone marrow crumb. Hey, what? There's a literal bone in there. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Like you know, he said he was inspired by the Desperate Dan Cow yeah, Pie yeah. with the bones coming out. What he's done is he's taken the bone marrow, combined it with breadcrumbs and parsley and blitzed it up. It's like a bone That's marrow right. jacuzzi Which is in lovely. the middle. <laughs> yeah. Oh. My favorite type of jacuzzi. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited about this. So look at this. Get some pastry on that, mm. on that kid. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. It is rich. Isn't oh, it? that is good. Yeah, the oh crumb. Oh my lord. Oh my gosh. That is crim that's criminal. Oh. Normally drinking jacuzzi water that's green should isn't advisable. Okay. But <laughs> this stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I know why you could come back here. Mm. Yeah, this is part of me. How's it going? Oh, unbelievable. That's ridiculous. 
Yeah, yeah, but we still got five other dishes to get on with. We're working, this we're working through. This is insanely good. I'm like genuinely blown away. I'm you haven't even tried the salmon yet, and that's weeping in the corner. That's true. <laughs> okay, so, oh, I have a question for you. Beautiful. Hit me. How are you with fishy flavours yeah, of like the fish. deep sea. Yeah, sure. You'd be surprised at the things I've eaten over the years. Well, I, just, so I thought that was a cracker, but that's a bit of fish this skin, is isn't crispy it? crispy skin. Crispy fish skin. Oh. Where all the omega-3 is. See, I told crispy you, advertising vitamins and supplements. <laughs> <Yeah>. You guys... <laughs> What is that brand? Is it called yeah. Wellness or something? Yeah. Wellman's, yeah, Wellman. Wellman. Well, David Gandhi. If you're watching, yeah. we'll do you a good deal, two for one. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Cheers, boys. Crispy skin. Cheers. With caviar, roe, and uh, whatever. Whatever that is. Mmm. It's an experience. Oh, that is an experience. Do you know what I mean? Mm hmm. One of the fishiest things I've ever eaten. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right by a long way. Wow. wow. It gets more fishy. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It's not my favourite thing that we've had today. <laughs> what about this this old bread? Just crispy. So, oh, yeah. very crispy. So that is basically that old bread rolled out. It's really good. What? Is it baked? You're gonna love that, Ollie. I guarantee you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You into that? The blandest thing on the table, Ollie absolutely loves. That is incredible. Old bread rolled out and made crispy. <laughs> I would take that over the pate. Shut up! Get any out day. Here. You're ridiculous. So, how did you decide on mm. Top Jaw, the name? This is a question we get asked a lot, and the real answer is we can't really 100% remember. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I didn't see that coming. No. Really? No, yeah, no. No. I just remember yeah, Will and I, one late night, yeah. sat in this office, like, fudging loads of words together. Okay. So we were like, we like the word wax, and we like the word flex. We like the word jaw, because J-A-W, Jesse and Will. Very good. And then top, because, I don't know, it's wow. better than bottom. <laughs> <laughs> I'm scared and excited as to what's coming next. Yeah, he said there's more. He said there's pudding, yeah. Oh my God! Whoa! <laughs> what is this? So we've got a wagon wheel. Those American viewers have this thing called a s'more because they just love eating s'more and s'more and s'more. Okay. okay? <laughs> now the difference between a wagon wheel oh and a God. s'more yes. is fire. Okay. okay. So we do a toasted marshmallow wagon wheel. So that's a <laughs> whoa. So we make these beautiful homemade marshmallows, oh. which then get wonderfully toasted. Wow. And with someone else's implements, they're still on fire. Yeah, they're okay. good like that. That's okay. They're going to yeah. get smothered. Oh, that, I just got a smell of that, and it yes. smells great. divine. Now, the other thing that we do, Arctic Roll is one of the classic supermarket freezer food successes from the 1970s. Vanilla ice cream, raspberry jam and sponge. Mm -hmm. But we got a little bit bored of doing that, so we went a bit more interesting. Terry's chocolate orange. Oh. We started experimenting with all sorts of weird things, including apple. Which goes very nicely with goat's cheese. Wow. Salty licorice. Last month's soda bread. Oh, you had today's, you did. had last week's, this is last month's. Fantastic. <laughs> and this one is your favourite takeaway that you've never had in an ice cream form. So we've got a Thai green curry. Okay. No ch chicken, no prawns, because that really would be weird. But yeah. all the flavours of galangal, ginger, lemongrass, kaffir, lime, coconut, hint of chilli, all wrapped up into a beautiful Arctic roll. I kid you not. Wow. Start at the beginning and finish at the end. Fantastic. This one. Oh, Whoa, yeah. Wow. Massacre. <laughs> oh my gosh. Did you see that? Just implode. Perfectly melted. Mmm. Mm. Mmm. Mmm. Rich dark chocolate. The biscuit. Oh, what I like about the biscuit is really, really crackly. Yeah. It contrasts with the marshmallows perfectly, right? Yeah. That is ridiculous. Mm -hmm. mm. What? That is insanely good. For anyone at home watching, you come to a normal British pub, order a Sticky toffee pudding. Yep. You can't go wrong, it's gonna be good. If <laughs> you come here, nah, just put sticky toffee pudding. It's a shame, what's the point? Also, if you order that a is... wagon wheel, you may, some pubs <laughs> may give you one, but it's not like that. Right, let's go on this Arctic journey. That, that's the classic roll. vanilla yeah. sponge Arctic roll. Yeah, wow, okay. Mm. 
and I like the ice cream to mm. roll ratio. Mm. It's my complaint with Arctic mm. Rolls. Too thick. There's just, there's not enough. <laughs> it's too much roll. So this is this is Terry, Terry's chocolate Shit. orange. Cheers. Cheers. Okay. Okay. Mm. Chocolatey. Mm. Yeah, chocolatey. No, I'm not mm. that orangey. A little orange. Apple and goat cheese, ladies and gents. Yeah, very curious about how this one's going to taste. Are it? you more or less curious about this than the Thai green curry one? Oh, good point. I've never had cheese flavoured ice cream. Oh my god. It's cheesy, oh. boys. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so... It is goat cheesy. Oh, it's... It's a very strong cheese flavour. Yeah. I really don't like that. Are we doing all right? We're oh, doing yeah. fantastic. The goat's cheese one really threw me. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> These boys one. are not fan of the goat's cheese. <laughs> I thought it was going to be inspired by goat's cheese. What's this one? Licorice. Salted licorice. Oh, yeah. I'm interested by this one. Not usually a fan of licorice. Salted licorice in general is like the most intense like form licorice. of licorice. That really works. Mm, that really works. It's minty. Minty licorice is a lot better than salty licorice. Yeah. That's actually really nice. Oh, I love yeah, that. You are, you are. I think that's you're my favorite right, so right. far. The month old bread one. The other that day. is awesome. I love that. That is just like those crackers. Yeah. <laughs> you're a weird bloke, you know that. That's beautiful. <laughs> just categorically. <laughs> it has been just said. No, that's beautiful. I think that's incredible. It tastes like orange peel. No, not overly. Oh, that is so good. I, that's incredible. That's my favorite so far. Yeah. That's my favorite. What? <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right, last up. What's this one? What was this one again? I keep thinking Thai watermelon. Green curry. It looks like watermelon. Thai, Thai green curry. It's very pink for Thai green curry. Right, it can't possibly be worse than the last one. <laughs> okay. Mmm. Very fragrant. Oh. Oh, that is good. It has just slight hints of the green curry. Definitely, like, that is the taste. If yeah, someone yeah. asked you what that tasted like, you'd say Thai green like, curry. Like, like, that's good. Like, me, like, ghost, the ghost cheese one is, like, very savoury. Yeah. Oh, I don't enjoy Which that. Which is weird for an ice cream. Yeah. But yeah. that one's like... That one's lovely. Jesse, this has wow. been genuinely amazing. This is, this is actually like an un unforgettable meal. Massively surpassed my expectations. Best pub meal I've ever had by I a mean, long, long I'm way. I'm very pleased, but am I surprised? No. <laughs> wow, okay. And, and can we raise a glass, an empty glass, okay. for the one that is not here to well, my partner Will? In the meantime... We'll see you jolly soon. <laughs> see you jolly soon, guys. Bye! Bye.